What's up everyone? Welcome back. Today we're up here looking at the Volkswagen. Um, it's been two weeks since we've been up uh, because we had Memorial Day last week and we it was a short week and we had three days of work done on the car. Really wasn't any point in filming it so we just decided to skip that and we'll do a big video today. Um, as of right now while you're watching this we are at 98 subscribers so if you guys could do me a favor subscribe let's get up over 100 on this video i would love to make that happen uh that'd be a huge milestone for this but for the volkswagen we do have this all done um it's pretty much done we still got a little bit of cleanup done to do but you can see how that turned out here on this side um we do have a bunch of footage from that so we're going to jump to that right now show you guys two weeks worth of footage working on it and we'll come back and show you the finished piece. All right, so you guys saw what we've been up to, saw how we made the piece, all that stuff. Um, but that's where we're at. So we got this all done. Uh, it's all spot welded up across here. You can kind of see the weld line all the way down and all through there. Um, we still got to finish right there. We got one little piece we got to finish, but this we didn't have to cut out like we did on the other side this stayed in we just pulled the panel off the back but this is all done looks really clean really happy with how it came out um it looks it's a lot smoother than that side just because it's all new um that side's just kind of i don't know it looks good but it's not flat we don't really know why um, it was like that before we did it. That just that side was never flat. Um, we know the car was rear-ended at some point. We don't know if that contributed to it, but just not very flat. But the rail is ready to go in. The rail is sitting right up there in the front. Um, that's what we're going to be working on the rest of this week and tomorrow. And first part of next week, we'll get the new rail. I'll put up through here, and. Uh, that's probably where we're going to be at next week. On next week's video is uh, that rail will be welded in and finished and we'll be ready to move on. Um, the plan after this is done, um, after next week when the rail is in, we still have to do both wheel wells, but kind of just want to break from the back. We've been working on it so long. So we're going to come up here and we're going to finish this front i know that was what we started the project on we have the new carmen Ghia parts though so we're gonna try and finish the front um that's the plan as of now we're gonna get this front all down in here done and then once that's done we can get this whole frame rail put in or the uh, the rocker panel we can get that put in once that rocker panel is in, we can finish welding this because this isn't welded right along here on the inside or out just because we can't yet. Once the rocker's in, all these posts are gonna come out and we'll put posts off the bottom of the rockers down. Just make sure it doesn't sag because this pillar needs work. 
And once all of that's done, then we can continue over here to this side. Um, but we can't move the pillar because it's tight against this. So this needs to come out before we can weld this on. But if you see, if you put this flush, it's flush at the bottom and it's sitting in at the top. But on the back, if you put it flush here, it sits out at the top. So if we lay this pillar in and line the gap up on the front door all the way around, that will push the top in here and we'll line this door up all the way around. So we can't align the doors until that top bar is out. Can't take the top bar out until the rocker panel is done. So that's where we're at. At this point, the goal is fronts, and then we're going to work on both rockers. We'll get that front pillar done over there, and then we can get the front all finished up. Um, so that's this week's video. That's where we're at. There's the new frame rail sitting here. Um, but like I said, we're at 98 subscribers. We're two away from 100. I would love to hit 100. Um, videos are picking up a bunch of traction we're getting way more views than we were things are really working um i'm happy i love hearing from you guys you know we've been getting comments or two on every video love hearing from you guys so if you guys like what you see if you want to keep keep up on the project subscribe comment like i want to hear from you guys but other than that that'll be it for today's video and we look forward to talking to you next week. See you later.